lovelies welcome back to another video welcome back to the family how are you all doing hope you all are doing well all right i want to thank almighty god for another bright and beautiful day in today's video i'll be sharing with you how to grow your t airline your t edges your breakage fast in a month like in a month as you can see on this first clip you are watching right now my edges are off because of stress health issue and postpartum shedding so i don't panic i know how to grow them back fast so over here is the second week of me doing this air growth treatment and look at how my airline is looking forgive the poor lighting lovelies because i was filming this video out here with my phone and in a very poor light <laughs> so over here as you can see my airline are coming out really really well gradually but is coming out so i will share with you all the stuff i use to grow my airline whenever i'm experiencing breakage because i don't stress my air but sometimes due to earth issue i experience shedding and all of that so it's normal to some of us ladies over here is the third week of me doing this treatment and look at how my edges are looking like guys this is huge this is huge and trust what i say it's amazing so if you are badly with ta line breakage slow growth postpartum shedding alopecia like whatever you are going through with your airline trust me when i say this recipe is for you it's going to help you a lot if only you try and watch this clip to the end and follow all the guidelines so here is one more update of me doing this treatment and look at how my hair is looking guys i not go to any uh, hair doctor all i do is my diy recipe on my airline and my hair this is what I got in one month. So if you can do this again and again and again and again, trust me, in a year, you are going to cover up all your bath spots without spending anything on your hair. And trust when I say you are going to love this recipe, okay? It's for all hair type. It's for everybody, okay? Men, women, boys, guests, low prostate, high prostate, anyone you have, this airline is for you. So let me show you guys how I make this secret, easy, natural recipe to grow your bar air fast. The first thing I will need is my blender. Yeah, so I'll go in with pinch of my aloe vera plant. What I do is that I make little quantity, I consume it in a week, then the next week I'll make another one. Okay. I don't make it large, just make the one you can consume in a week, then you finish it, then you try and make another one for a month. So over here, I'm taking off the skin of the aloe vera. If you have delicate skin, delicate airline, then remove the skin because the skin has some trace of poison. You don't want it to irritate your scalp. So after I remove the skin, I'm going to chop my aloe vera into a dice form. Then I will throw it into my blender over here. I have my frozen aloe vera. If you add the fresh one, that's good as well. Then my next ingredient will be my white half onions. In case you don't know or if you know, I love onions a lot. And onions has been helping my hair right from when I went natural and when I was suffering from postpartum shedding drastically. Onions has an amazing, amazing nutrient that helps your hair to grow really, really well. It increases your suffer and makes your hair to grow healthy. Then I will go in with this my amount of my ginger ginger is small recipe i will not take out of my hair regimen because of the amazing benefit it gives to my hair it stimulates my hair increases blood flow on my hair and also strengthening my bar spot to make my hair grow really really healthy thick for my scalp then after i cut my ginger i will go in with one spoon of my flaxseed guys if you are caramelizing flaxseed 
please stop it it has omega-3 that rejuvenates your hair nourish your your hair strengthening your hair and make your hair to grow really really thick and healthy from your scalp then i will go in with three spoon of my extra virgin olive oil we all know the amazing benefits olive oil has on our hair then i will apply my oil into my blender alongside with my ingredient if you want you can apply a little bit of water into yours for easy blending because i have small water into my for easy blending then right now i'm going to cover it up then i am going to blend into a smooth consistency So lovelies, after blending, it's time to strain the juice from the pulp. Please don't apply the recipe like this on your hair. It will stuck on your hair and that will be double breakage for you. So you don't have to strain it like this as you can see me doing. If you don't have this white stuff, use your stock to strain your juice from the pulp as you can see me doing. Then my next ingredient will be my mango and lime Jamaica black castor oil. Any castor oil you add, just apply it. Castor oil darkens, nourish and thickens your hair cuticles and your scalp as well. Then I will go in with my vitamin E oil. It replenish, it nourish and also it build your hair, your scalp, all right? Then I will go in with 10 drops of my tea tree essential oil. It has antibacterial that fight against any scalp irritation. Then I will go in with my meat essential oil. I will apply 10 drops as well of my meat essential oil. If you are arguing with the smell, then you can apply lavender oil. But me, I'm used to onion smell, but I love to apply lavender as well into my recipe. Then right now, I am going to stir everything together. Like what I said before, I will make this quantity just for a week. I apply this recipe three times in a week on my airline. Yes, three times in a week. If you watch to the end, I will show you all how I apply it step by step, things I do and things I don't do to create my air line back because when you are treating your air please there are things you must not do while treating your airline so here is my recipe this one will last me for a week after a week i will make another one that i continue the treating process so lovely let me show you how i apply it over here look at my recipe is half okay so what i do is that i apply the recipe into my hairline as you can see just delicately if you prefer to grow any part of your hair like your crown section just apply the recipe you are good to go so i will just put some amount into my hairline then i will just massage guys you want to massage this recipe into your hair really really well and delicately please don't use your nails use your hands to massage as you can see me doing when massaging your your, your hair like, like this it air blood to flow into your scalp and make your hair to grow and treat your hair and lovelies the massage is dope i'm telling you all <laughs> So after I massage my hair, I will cover my hair up for 30 minutes to eat up. If you like, you can put it all to every part of your hair. But me, I'm treating my hairline. But once in a week, I apply it all over my hair. Then after 30 minutes, I am going to rest it out. As you can see, then I will condition my hair 
eh, yes lovelies when you eventually raise out the treatment please condition your hair really really well i go in with my granier regular condition use any one of your choice you are good to go i will apply a little piece of my condition apply it to my airline massage it really really well then as you can see me doing the after that i will cover it up for five minutes again the after five minutes i'm going to raise it out of my airline lovelies please condition your air when you take out the recipe one it will condition the or your hair line at the same time it will also help with the smell of the onions so i will cover it up for five minutes after five minutes then i will raise it out look at how my airline is looking so after i raise the condition out of my hair there is time to moisturize my hair i will go in with my onions and my aloe vera hair growth butter sometimes i use my hair grease or sometimes i use my diy ginger hair growth butter but if you have castor oil just apply if you have like shea butter just apply any butter of your choice just apply a lovely massage the butters i use my onions butter my ginger butter and my diy grease air growth um, pomade i'll put the link down below in case you want to make yours it's so easy and also it's super duper effective then after that i will go in with this my delicate brush don't brush my airline together as you can see lovely please if you are the type that love to slay your edges put edge control you have to stop that for a lot to that your, your airline can grow really really well don't put tension on your air then lastly i will go in with my air bonnet this one is amazingly important when apply your bonnet please don't allow it to stick on your airline let it come to your forehead as you can see me doing like this is a no no then you can protect your airline this is how you can grow your hair with the recipe i show you all and it's super duper effective and thank you all for watching if you like it please give me a huge thumbs so it will help you get a lot until i'll see you in the next one remain blessed i know what peace bye bye